Hi everyone, so editing this video I realized I never filmed an intro, so here it goes. I'm Tatiana, I'm 22, and I'm a med student. Um, I decided to do this vlog, which by the title you can tell that this is a white coat ceremony vlog, because back in February I was diagnosed with cancer and I was almost certain that this wouldn't be possible for me to start school undergoing treatment. Um, I was ready to kind of give it up but I decided to keep going and I'm just so, so beyond amazed and grateful that I've been able to get to this place. I'm so grateful that I have my white coat a week and a half ago and I'm just so happy. And I wanted to have this video so I could look back on it 20 years from now, even five years from now, and just remember how amazing it's been and kind of remind myself that you know I've got this. It's hard, life's hard, but there's moments that make it all worth it and this is one of them. So I'm sharing it with you guys to show you that chasing after your dreams is so very worth it. Without further ado, this is my White Coast Ceremony vlog and I hope you enjoy it. And then this necklace my dad got for me as a gift. We went shopping the day before the white coat for my accessories and I saw it and so he gave it to me the day of as a surprise. That's my dad right there. <laughs> and then those are my siblings in the back. We were in such a hurry to get there because we were late that I was walking and I fell on my way to the car. Right there on my knees. They were freaking bleeding. It was awful because I just never learned how to walk in heels. And anyway, here we are at the white coat. Here the speaker was talking about how as doctors we should be the biggest advocates for socialized healthcare and I really really appreciated it because it's as a cancer patient I know how hard it can be to find healthcare, how to afford healthcare in a country like this one and I just really appreciated that he took his time to talk about that during his speech. Tatiana Polanco Rodriguez. It was at this point that I started tearing up really badly. Um, it's been a long road to get to here. Uh, when I was diagnosed, I sincerely never thought I would get this far. I remember asking my doctor if it was even possible for me. And so, through all those tears, I ended up almost walking off the stage, right there. Yep, did you see that? Here I am with my mom, she put on my stethoscope, and we cried a little bit more.
And well, I wanted to finish off the vlog here. Um, the speaker showed this at the end, and it says that no matter what measures are taken, doctors will sometimes falter, and it isn't reasonable to ask that we achieve perfection. What is reasonable to ask is that we never see to aim for it, and I think that's really important to keep in mind because we aren't gods, and we need to remember that the most important thing is to just keep our patients in mind, keep their health in mind, and try and, and minimize the errors that we make. But sometimes we will mess up, and that's okay because we're human. I'm just glad that I've been able to keep going and surround myself with people who support me and are there to help me throughout the whole process and I'm so excited to take you guys on this journey with me so if you'd like to follow hit the like button and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video bye